Welcome to Stock Invest YouTube channel and this stock report for Tesla. The report was first published on our website Tuesday, October 25, 2022, but this is a more detailed version. Our aim is to help you answer the question, should I buy or sell Tesla? In this video, you will get insight into the technical and fundamental situation and future price predictions. Please remember to subscribe, hit like and notification bell so you will be first to know when we post a new updated video. Since September 26, 2022, our system ranks the Tesla stock as a sell candidate, giving it a score of minus 2.858. In this period the stock has had a loss of minus 19.42%. This is an average return of minus 0.88% per day since first recommended. In our daily updates for Tesla our last headline reads, Strong day for Tesla stock price on Tuesday rising 5.29% to $222.42. The Tesla stock price gained 5.29% on the last trading day, Tuesday, October 25, 2022, rising from $211.25 to $222.42. During the last trading day the stock fluctuated 6.83% from a day low at $210 to a day high of $224.35. The price has risen in 7 of the last 10 days and is up by 2.73% over the past 2 weeks. Volume fell on the last day by minus 4 million shares and in total, 96 million shares were bought and sold for approximately $21.35 billion. You should take into consideration that falling volume on higher prices causes divergence and may be an early warning about possible changes over the next couple of days. In the last 52 weeks, the highest price of the stock was $414.50, and the lowest price was $198.59. Right now the price is 46.34%, or $192.08, below 52-week high and 75.3%, or $677.99, below all-time high January 25, 2021 where the price hit $900.40. The stock lies in the middle of a very wide and falling trend in the short term and further fall within the trend is signaled. The current three-month trend indicates a possible minus 25.16% change over the next three months, with a possible return between minus 34.05% and minus 17.56%. The 12-month trend it indicates a minus 29.52% change over the next 12 months with a possible return between minus 49.65% and minus 9.53%. This equals a price between $111.99 and $201.23 after a year. Analyst Ratings and Price Targets From analysts Tesla stock received a general strong buy rating. The analysts give PE ratio a strong buy and price to book a strong buy rating. For the return on investment the analysts give the Tesla stock a neutral rating. In this section we will give you some information about signals found for Tesla. We will start with the general picture before we move on some of the most famous indicators and signals that will give you a deeper and better understanding of the trading possibilities in the stock. A buy signal was issued from a pivot bottom point on Friday, October 14, 2022 and so far it has risen 8.5%. Further rise is indicated until a new top pivot has been found. Furthermore, there is a buy signal from the three-month moving average convergence divergence MACD. Volume fell during the last trading day despite gaining prices. This causes a divergence between volume and price and it may be an early warning. The stock should be watched closely. Some negative signals were issued as well, and these may have some influence on the near short-term development. The Tesla stock holds a buy signal from the short-term moving average, at the same time, however, the long-term average holds a general sell signal. Since the long-term average is above the short-term average there is a general sell signal in the stock giving a more negative forecast for the stock. On further gains, the stock will meet resistance from the long-term moving average at $258.17. On a fall, the stock will find some support from the short-term average at $216.71. A breakup through the long-term average will give another buy signal, while a fall below the short-term average will add another sell signal and strengthen the general signal. 
Here are some other signals you might find interesting. Moving average convergence divergence holds a buy signal. Pivots gave a buy signal 8 days ago. Bollinger gave a buy signal 17 days ago. The short-term moving average for the 3-month chart gave a buy signal 2 days ago. The long-term moving average for the 3-month chart gave a sell signal 25 days ago. The relation between the short and the long moving averages in the 3-month chart gave a buy signal 22 days ago. If we look at the 12-month chart we see, short moving average gave a buy signal 2 days ago. The long-term moving average gave a sell signal 18 days ago. The relation between the short and the long moving averages gave a buy signal 14 days ago. Remember to go to our page at stockinvest.us if you want to find more signals. Support, Risk and Stop Loss for Tesla On the downside, the stock finds support just below today's level from accumulated volume at $211.25 and $207.28. There is a natural risk involved when a stock is testing a support level, since if this is broken, the stock then may fall to the next support level. In this case, Tesla finds support just below today's level at $211.25. If this is broken, then the next support from accumulated volume will be at $207.28 and $204.99. This stock may move much during the day, volatility, and with a large prediction interval from the Bollinger Band this stock is considered to be high risk. During the last day, the stock moved $14.35 between high and low, or 6.83%. For the last week, the stock has had daily average volatility of 5.75%. Let us have a look at some fundamental data you should be aware of before we tell you some possible good trading levels for Tesla. The price to earnings ratio (PE ratio) is the ratio for valuing a company that measures its current share price relative to its per share earnings. Tesla currently has a price earning ratio of 96.81. A high price to earnings ratio could mean that a company's stock is overvalued or else that investors are expecting high growth rates in the future. Here are some possible good day trading levels. On an upturn, Tesla meets first resistance at $242.40. If you do not hold Tesla shares you should wait for this level to be broken before placing your bet. If you already have the stock this is the level you may want to swing trade. On a downturn Tesla finds first level of support at $211.25 and this is a natural place to put your bet if the support holds with an expectation of a rebounce upwards. In the table we have listed other potential swing trading levels based on the, the famous Fibonacci model. The average ratings combined from several analyst sources for Tesla is strong buy. Here are some of the latest insider trades. On October 4, 2022 Kirkhorn Zachary made an inside sell of 3,750 of common stock. On September 27, 2022 Baglino Andrew D. made an inside sell of 10,500 of non-qualified stock option, right to buy. On September 27, 2022 Baglino Andrew D. made an inside sell of 10,500 of common stock. On September 27, 2022 Baglino Andrew D. made an inside buy of 10,500 of common stock. On September 12, 2022 Kirkhorn Zachary made an inside sell of 3,750 of common stock. Based on the 100 latest insides trades, we have calculated the insider power to be negative at a ratio of minus 92.863. In total, the insiders bought 101,184 and sold 4,805,522 shares in the last 100 trades. We hold a negative evaluation for this stock, no stop loss set. Is Tesla stock a buy? Tesla holds several negative signals and we believe that it will still perform weekly in the next couple of days or weeks. We, therefore, hold a negative evaluation of this stock. After analyzing the volatility and movements for the last trading day our systems find that the current price is overvalued. For the trading on Wednesday 26th we expect Tesla to open down minus $3.49 and start trading at $218.92. We remind you that trading involves a high risk of losing money, and that you should speak with a financial advisor before buying or selling any securities. You should not base your investment decision upon stockinvest.us.
by using the information you agree and are held liable for your own investment decisions. That's the end of this video, thanks for watching. And remember to subscribe to the channel to get all the latest videos and updates.